hi everyone so god is saying that someone is watching you someone is busy tracking you down but they don't know the implications so here we are talking about tomorrow and tomorrow being the 17th and here when you're reading the book of psalms chapter 17 verse 11 and remember we are in the 11th month of the year the bible says they have tracked me down they now surround me with ice alert to throw me to the ground when you read verse 14 it says by your hand save me from such people lord from those of this world whose reward is in this life may what you have stored up for the wicked fill their bellies may their children gorge themselves on it and may they be left over for their little ones as for me, I will be vindicated and I will see your face. When I awake, I will be satisfied with seeing your likeness. So God is saying that, yes, they might have surrounded you. Yes, they might be planning evil upon your life. Yes, they might have asked, been setting you up. They might have been trying to do things on you, but they don't understand the implications. It's not only just about them. They the effects or the impact of the things that they have been planning to do unto you god is saying that they will suffer the consequences and not only them even their children are going to suffer the consequences and not only them they will also be left over also for their grandchildren just imagine they are messing up with the entire generation just because of the things that they plan to do on you this god will still fight for you this this God will still rise up and confront them in the mighty name of Jesus. This God is still going to bring them down. When you read in the book of Psalms chapter 17 verse 13, the Bible says, Rise up, Lord, confront them, bring them down with your sword, rescue me from the wicked. So God is still going to be rescuing you from the wicked. Fear not, the Lord is with you. The fire of God surrounds you in the mighty name of Jesus. Don't be scared at all. Don't be scared because the lord is your defender god will fight for you god is the one who is the mighty warrior he won't leave you alone he will not leave you nor forsake you in the mighty name of jesus the plans of the enemies are not going to work not this time not this time not this time it's them and their families who are going to be suffering and they won't understand why now their children are suffering but it will be because of what they have been doing to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.